Yes, 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 I have a new toy. Here's my new toy. A 36 inch four burner griddle. <laughs> my wife gave me this thing and I'm ready for summer now. I'm ready for summer. There you have it. 36 inches, four burners, flap top griddle. Hey, listen, listen to this, 123 pounds. It really matters. I almost broke my, almost broke mines. So make sure you get some help. So I'm gonna put this together. Remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel and share with your friends and family. I'm gonna put this grill together. You can do it on your own. I'm not gonna go step by step, but I did put it together by myself. It took me a little over an hour and I did it. Here you have it. Here you have it. So now what do we have to do? We have to season this for the first use. So let's season our griddle. First of all, what do you need for a griddle? What do you need? Usually what do you need? So you need a bottle of water, bottle of oil. Those are the main essentials. You could have additional bottles for other things like sauces and things. You need like uh, the long thongs there and a surface, surface thermometer here because you need to make sure the temperature on that flap top uh, and it varies from corner to corner, from to back. So heat gloves and a dome like this that will help you cook sometimes. You need some steam in there. So a dome like this is always, always welcome. And one of these weights here, so to keep the meat close to the flap top there. Burgers and steaks and all that. And scrapers, any shape. They're coming in different shapes and forms. I have these two. Uh, you can buy the ones that you want. And obviously our spatulas here. This is what makes that beautiful sound and the feeling of having a griddle outdoor. Summer's here and let's start, let's start with this. So the first thing you gotta season that griddle for the first time. This surface is brand, brand new. It's not ready to cook until we season it. So using some of that oil and paper towels, Paper towels are your friends. You're gonna learn that in the griddle. Paper towels are your friends. So using the thongs here, I'm gonna grab some of these yeah. paper towel and I'm gonna spread my oil all over the griddle. You don't wanna be excessive, but you have to cover the griddle surface in its totality. So you make sure you get oil all over your surface and don't forget the walls as well. So make sure you reach every corner and all the surface there with oil. If you need more oil, you can put more oil. But also remember, don't forget those walls. The walls inside, you gotta make sure you put some oil there as well as the walls outside. Especially, especially in this first time seasoning of your new griddle. So there you have it. I'm gonna also use some oil for the outside here, especially for the first time here. So I'm gonna go all around making sure there's oil all over my surfaces inside and out, not underneath. So the flat top is all oil and now I'm gonna turn on all the burners in high. All the burners turn on in high. So you put them in high, all the burners, and this is gonna get pretty hot up there like in 500, 600 degrees. So once you turn this on, don't touch that grill again. That's why you need the, the long thumbs there with the paper towel. But remember, we're gonna season this about four to four, four to five times, we're gonna do the same thing. So that oil is gonna burn and it's gonna, the surface is gonna change color. You're gonna see in this video. So you put more oil every time. You're gonna repeat the same steps four to five times. You have to burn that oil on the surface. That's gonna season your griddle. And sometimes you have to do this again, uh, you know, periodically, depending on how, how much you use it and how much moisture gets on the surface. You see how it starts to turn the color there? That is totally normal. Actually, the entire flat is gonna get dark, almost like it's burned. It is not burned. That is called the seasoning. So I did it the first time, now I'm gonna do the same second time here. You see how I put all oil? all over don't be shy but don't be excessive just make sure that there's oil covering your flat top from side to side from to back 
and this is a beautiful beautiful feeling right here i'm seasoning my reader for the first time use there you go so make sure you hit all the corners all the walls with that oil including the walls outside especially in this first time setup and let that oil burn again let it burn again remember four or five times do not do it less than four times do not do it for less than four times you see how the oil is burning that's what you want to see that's what you want to see and when the oil goes out you're going to put more oil and more oil you see how it's almost all changing color it's going to get even more dark there you have it it's almost all dark except for the front because the front of that grill is where or the cold area is hard so you got to know your zones the front of that flat up here it's cold than the middle so that's why it's burning more on the back so you gotta know your temperatures all around your flat top here so you see how dark it is now this is ready for the first cook now that it's ready i did it five times we're gonna lower all the burners down to low lower all the burners down to low and this is something you're gonna learn to go the temperature control so i'm gonna keep this in low I'm gonna check for temperature here and you see how here in the corner I have 375 but in the hot zone back there it's 481 so on degree difference so I'm gonna put some of these uh, carne asada uh, smoke pork loin that I did in another video so a smoke pork loin here this is my first cook I'm so happy Oi. First cook in my flat top 36 inch four burner griddle. I'm gonna put some uh, tortillas here on the flat top. And you can put some sauce on that meat if you want. I'm just gonna put cheese this time around because the meat already had a little bit of sauce when I cooked it. So uh, I don't think I need it, but if you want it, that's up to you. So we're gonna flip these tortillas here. And I'm going to add some shredded cheese on top of the tortillas and more cheese on top of our pork. This is the first cook. We're doing the first one. We're breaking the seal. Breaking the seal here. The first cook of my flat top griddle. We're going to have so many recipes in this channel for this griddle. You're going you're gonna to love it. Just subscribe to my channel, like this video, and share with your friends and family. Tell everybody that I got a new toy. I'm waiting for recipes to cook on this new griddle here. So we have our carne asada taquitos here. Uh, obviously, I'm going to add some cilantro here on top. And these are simple, simple carne asada taquitos here. And I'm going to give it a try here. Give it a try. got to be good. First time cooking in my griddle. Ooh, and he passed the test. He passed the test. This is so good, I want to dance. So good carne asada taquitos. There you have it. I hope you enjoy it and you will enjoy the future recipes that I'll be doing in my new toy, my new 36-inch griddle. I'll see you next time.